In this video, I'm going to review the Pandoc integration, which I've included in my configuration of NeoVim for writing LaTeX documents. So let's open up NeoVim. We're going to go into this project here. And so this is a LaTeX document. And if for some reason I wanted to turn it into a Word document, then Pandoc is a useful tool in order to do that. So I have it under P for Pandoc, so we're going to open that up. And then these are the file formats, which we're going to then convert the open buffer, so in this case test.tech, uh, into. So let's try converting it to Word, so I'll do W. And so it, what this does is it opens up the terminal and it runs this pandoc command. And so let's close the terminal. And if we open up the Explorer, we can see we have this new untracked file, um, test.docx. And so if I were to try to open that just with enter, um, it doesn't look like much inside NeoVim um, because it's a Word file but I can open it with my system with S. And so I don't have Microsoft Word, but um, LibreOffice shows, and it does a reasonable job. It doesn't get everything right, um, but you know you can see the glossary stuff doesn't work very well, but it did get this little bit of um, math right. So so yeah, not, not a terrible product, um, potentially useful. Okay, so that's how to convert this document into Word. We can do the same thing for Markdown. So I'm gonna open up Pandoc and run W again. And okay, let's see what happened. So now we have todo.docx. So let's open that up with the system. And here's our little list, um, looks pretty good. All right, um, and you know potentially you could also um, convert LaTeX into Markdown if you wanted. So let's see how that comes out. So let's go into Pandoc, and now we'll produce a Markdown instead. Okay, and so now we should have. Let's see, test dot Markdown right there. Okay, and doesn't look too bad um, you know it doesn't get everything right but it's it's at least a start um, so yeah some things are easier than others um, but yeah nice to have this option available to you um, especially you know sometimes word documents are requested um, it is possible to use pandoc to convert word documents into latex documents um, it's a lot harder to get that to work well. Um, and it's not a feature that I really make much use of. Um, and so, you know, there's no easy way to um, open up a Word document inside NeoVim and to run which key, to use which key to run commands on it. So um, I won't include that, but, um, but you definitely can if, uh, if that's something you care to do.